It's the 22nd ever offline TV podcast. Today we're sponsored by sponsored, sponsored by Comfy Beats. No, there's a new song. Um, today was it? I think it was today. Yes, it was today. Thank you for keeping up, Saikun. I really appreciate it. Today oh, we are uh, joined by Saikuno. Saikuno, yes. tell us. Yep. Sa- Saikuno is uh, a streamer and a YouTuber for those uh-huh. who don't know him. Most of you probably know him if you ever watch any one of our streams. How long have you been doing the content game, Saikuno? Uh, well, like, well, I started YouTube a long time ago. But I didn't really start streaming a lot till like about last year or so. How long is a long time ago? Like eight years ago. Eight um, years you've been in this game. So what, what convinced you well, to start streaming? Oh, um, uh, Lily, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing like that? Um, Sorry. Sorry, go on, go on. Yeah. Uh, wow, am I going to tell this whole stuff? Like, I... Um, I just wanted to make friends, I guess, and uh, at the time, Lily was actually the only person who even talked to me, so, like, we didn't talk, like, a whole lot, but the only person who, like, He was very lonely. To... Wait, wait, who reached out yeah. first? Okay, uh, so, I did. let me, I did. let me tell oh. a story. Back in 2013, oh. I believe, See, was that season three world? Oh, around, season roughly three worlds, around yep. there, right? Very long time ago. Uh, some of my fans informed me, hey, there's this guy who wants to like meet up with you. He's another YouTuber. I'm like, okay. Say Kuno. Say Kuno. Okay, all right, I'm down. <clears throat> so uh-huh. like, we meet up. And I, I like, hey, I'm here. Where are you? And he, he shows up, right? And he has like a bouquet of flowers. I'm like, oh my God, uh, is this guy a fan? Uh, I'm like, no, I, guys. I just, okay. <laughs> It's, and I, he gives I, I it thought to me. I was told when you meet famous people, you, you they get flowers. I was what I thought. <laughs> so um, I got a bouquet of flowers, and then um, I took a picture, and then sweet. and then he had like his other friends, and then he just kind of like slinked away. Yeah, actually, that was my that was my cousin. Um, I didn't I didn't have fr- uh, but your cousin can be a friend, right? Like, I mean, I, yes, yes, that was my cousin friend. And then we um, became friends. That's it. Uh huh. He showed up with a bouquet of flower and then waved his cousin away. <laughs> so it's just the two of you. Oh, no, 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 no. I ran back to my cousin because I was he too scared. Went back. So I, uh, I got really nervous because I'm not used to like, ta- uh, yeah, I just, I just got scared, you know, um, ran to the safety of my a friend cousin, if you want to call it that. Friend cousin. Yeah. Um, you look like you're deep in thought. Tell us what's up. No, I'm just uh, I'm just surprised that uh, huh? he showed up with a bouquet of flowers. Like I, I like when I meet people, I don't show up with a bouquet of flowers. You know what? Not many people do. Yeah, I don't either. Uh, yeah, I'll I be honest. Was... I am not the most uh, experienced in meeting people. I just thought it was a, I. Um, <clears throat> you know, I I've never done that again. Um. Just if that 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 was the only time you've done it. That was the only time I've done it. Yeah, it's uh, maybe it was a little weird. It, it sounds like everyone too. thinks it's a little weird. Um, if this wait, how many likes do we get in like podcast, podcast. videos? Mm, Twenty thousand. If this gets thirty thousand likes, I will release the first photo I've ever taken with Sekuno. <laughs> with Lily, me I holding think the bouquet I'm pretty of sure you've already released that. <laughs> I mean, yes, you'll release it again. Why you gotta fucking do uh, that, man? Well, look, someone's uh, like someone. I, I mean, well, maybe people still would want it a second time. Um, uh, okay. 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 <clears throat> <clears throat> Lily, you have something to say? No, no, no. I just let's let's get the ball rolling. Okay, let's you know? get the ball rolling. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, All right, Saikuno. You know, the comments are just going to be filled with stuff like, um, you know, you know, it's kind of cool. have you seen uh, people's comments on you, both positive and negative, you know, on, uh, um, on the, you know, the Reddit or the Twitter yeah, or the YouTube lot comments? Of, lot what, what do you some, see, Sekuno? Some examples. Let's see. Well, there's definitely positive and there's definitely a lot of negative. Okay. What kind of, um, what kind of positive comments do you normally see? 
I, I have a uh, I have a question. Is is someone saying like harem kuno? Is that is that a compliment? Because I don't. Yeah. I'm not. I would consider that, this a compliment. Yes. I uh, <laughs> then I, would. I I guess I see that a couple times. But but the truth, there's no, there is no har- harem harem. Do you, do you see Chad um, Kuno? Yes. Is that a compliment too, or is 100%. that? Hundred yeah. percent. Those are both compliments. Both of those compliments. Um. Yeah, I guess I see that the most, but I feel like they're just memeing. Um, because people make those compliments because they, uh, they they saw you on a, like a Twitch dating show. And I think each time you like the viewership's what forty thousand people, like um, about that forty thousand people yep. on two episodes uh, of this Twitch dating show that uh-huh. you've been on, and you've you've won both time, right? The the woman right, that's picked you and then when it's your turn to be the picker the uh-huh. woman you pick also agreed to like you know she picked yeah. love when she they chose picked, for me know. yes yeah. apparently all of them did that all of the them time. all 11 in in the history of the dating show all 11 female <clears throat> participants said i would like to choose love for saikuno when they could have chose yes. host which is more like they want clout kind of deal for themselves yeah yeah so they all basically they would Want me to succeed more than th- I don't actually know how it were. I was just there for. How does that know. make you feel? Huh? How does that make uh, you feel? It makes me feel like they're all very nice and I'm glad they were on the show with me. Um, nice. Do you think any of them wants to, uh, you know, get to know you better truly on, oh, a, on, a, um, on a deeper level? Some of them, I think so, but it's it's hard to tell, you know? I, um, and, uh, I think so, but I don't want to be like, you know, what, what if they don't actually, then, then it's kind of weird if I say that, that I'm going to give it a maybe, maybe, uh, only, only time will tell maybe is the way to put that. Um, oh, very cool. Yeah. Cool. Would, yeah. would you ever be interested in a show like that? I mean, uh, do it. Ooh. Tell us, uh-huh. this is your chance to, <clears throat> yeah, it's your chance. Oh, you got to be the bachelor. Yep. Mm, so, uh, I, don't, I don't think I can handle those women. I feel like no? they're, they're, some are quite, quite, char- quite the characters, and you know, I, uh, I am, a, I'm uh, a beta. We've been recently talking about this, but I'm kind of beta huh? and submissive. <laughs> okay, <laughs> right? Ah, uh, yes, you wanted uh, a mom. No, I didn't say <laughs> I wanted a mom. Oh, sorry. Um, a milf. Yeah, uh, <laughs> big booby milf GF. Um, and how exactly did you come across? Oh, oh, yeah. wait. So you're into girls that are older than you? Is that? I would He's like the only one. to know what it's like. I would like to experience being with an older, mature lady with big boobies and a dominant personality that will step on me, and in bed I will call her mommy. <clears throat> <laughs> Why am I in this podcast? You know, <laughs> um, yeah, you know, I. It's good to know what you want. That that's that's uh, yeah, respectable thing to know what you want. Is that something um, you know you want? Or no, I don't. You haven't something, tried. Well, that I he's have not tried that, okay. but I would right, like to try it. Yes. that's a good sign of an open mind. Yeah, you do yes. what makes you happy, Toast. Yeah, mm-hmm. if you bring home like big booby. You know, what what, what would your reactions be if I actually one day come home with a woman <laughs> and she's clearly in her late forties with like really big boobies? What, what would you do? Like you, you and Michael are in the kitchen and I'm walking. <clears throat> Honestly, you're an adult. She's an adult. Yeah. If you guys say, are I say, happy, I say hi, toasts, mom, and then <laughs> go on with the conversation. Hmm. <laughs> All right, why did why, why how did this topic become? Um, yeah. So, do you think Toast would you only date someone who plays games or? No, 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 no. no oh, no, no, no. I don't believe in putting restriction on. Um, not restriction, but like, look, love is such a such an open concept, right? Uh huh. Why let something like games keep me from finding someone with big boobies? <laughs> Um, <laughs> that is, is that open? My, I, yeah, I'm oh, not sure game, games to, is uh, very low on my list of things they need uh, to do. Okay. Oh, what's, uh, what's something high on your guys' list? 
Hmm. Passion. Hmm. Something high on the list. Sekuno has a huge female audience, by the way. I think like the highest I, no, I, out of everyone. I saw you know. that clip <laughs> on like the way you go into you went into your Discord and it turned out everyone was a girl. <laughs> Oh, 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 right. Well, well, here's what I think. I was just trying to. Is this about the Animal Crossing furniture? Yeah, right. that one. Right. Animal I was selling a pink bed to. So I, I only sold to subscribers because, like, didn't want to get trolled super hard by, you know, random people who might like. I also heard you can steal IPs from Dodo codes. So a little bit afraid of that. Uh, so I'm, I'm thinking it's just because, like, I was selling pink furniture and, it, and Animal Crossing, you know? So, like, Probably girls like pink furniture more than guys. I would guess. Don't don't know for sure. Just a massive coincidence, probably is what she I'm trying to. She has a very large female audience. Out of mm -hmm. all of us, very mm -hmm. admirable. Very yeah, massive coincidence. Massive uh, female audience. Massive, yes. Probably huge. some huge late forties. Biggest tits <laughs> in <laughs> yeah. imagination. At least a few of them. Yeah. Um, oh. I. Personally, can't I? I don't know. I um, yeah, mm -hmm. massive coincidence though. Mm -hmm. Even now, like mm -hmm. being on this podcast, and a lot of girls are watching. I bet, like after this, searching up his channel, searching up his Twitch stream. You know, he is single, ladies, and has a master's in statistics. Oh my! Oh. And a minors in mathematics. Right? So he's and educated. In mathematics, yeah. Same thing. Educated. Oh, wow. You know, I mm -hmm. feel like I'm not much smarter than Statistics. before, so, um... No, whenever you type something yeah. super smart in cacao, I'm always like, wow! That came off a little, like... No, Actually, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm pretty what, sure, what I'm pretty sure you said, Saikuno, it's very amusing when you type smart. See? <laughs> he, he remembered As in you the thought exact it was funny. wording <laughs> I used. That's how smart he is. I didn't even know that. No, it's because amusing means you thought it was, like, funny in a... I, um, lots of things in life are amusing. That doesn't mean it's bad, you know. Uh huh. My um, mustache is amusing, you know. Oh, Michael's it is. Shitty microphone is amusing. Uh, Toast's obsession with big booby milf. I'm sorry. Obsession. I think it's pretty normal <clears throat> to be into stuff like that. You make it sound like, you know, obsession. Like, I really... No, there's nothing wrong with No, I'm not saying I mean, that. He, like, I think like that more people like, people like this big I, boobies I, than people Preoccupation don't. with big booby milfs, okay? I, I would say the majority mm -hmm. of males are into big booby milfs. Michael, are you into... <laughs> <laughs> um, you, you might be saying that in the wrong group of... <laughs> Why don't we... Uh, okay, um, moving on. There's some nice Aikuno <clears throat> podcast topics here. Let's let's. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. How do you deal with all that negativity about you? Okay, Saikuno, what do people say about you that's negative? Um, a lot of personal attacks, and I'll say a lot of times, since I know that they're not true, it doesn't bother me that they're being negative. It bothers can, can me that. Can you uh, give us some examples, some quotes? Um, yeah, just quote it directly. Quotes directly. I, mean, oh, I don't like oh. save, ne but they do say a lot of stuff like, um, "Oh, he's like pretending he doesn't have a lot of." Or, but in the past, he's pretending he didn't used to have friends and uh, say stuff like that. Um, so obviously, like I know it's not true, so it, I don't feel bad about. The they comment. say you're fake, I just, right? Yeah, I just feel bad that people like misunderstand like they don't get you know what i mean um mm -hmm. i don't know the right way to put it i but... completely understand as yeah, a fellow like... infp type 9 wing uh, one what <laughs> nothing nothing <laughs> right Tickling. yeah so i think it bothers me more that people like don't bother trying to understand mm -hmm. and they just want to say hey. what you know or just like whatever they think of you they already have that yeah, image yeah. Of you. And they're they're not gonna change it. Like uh -huh. they don't wanna change it, right? It's easier to think yeah. of you as fake and not give you the chance because mm -hmm. that's easy. Yeah, so it feels worse that they like um I don't like it when people like don't understand what I'm saying or like not what I'm saying, but like they don't get it, but they like go really hard. Yeah. They're like, like very uh, certain that they get it when they obviously don't yeah, exactly yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. And they don't like talk to me about it. they just like you know uh, want to yeah. think about it a certain way 
such mm-hmm. as life of fame, I guess, just popularity in general, public figures. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Whatever I think, it is, what it is. I think the way I'd put it is, um, so in school, right, you learn about logic and stuff. So there's one method where you look at the evidence and try to come to a certain conclusion, right? And then the other way is you already have a solution or conclusion you want to get to, and then you try and find the right evidence to make yourself get so, there. Almost like confirmation right, yeah. bias. So, um, a little bit. Um, okay. So that's usually I I don't know if that made any sense. No, no, that um, makes super. It's like <clears throat> people thinking you're if you, people think you're bad or fake, they're gonna try to look up anything that. Like yeah, exactly. To try and get to... That. Yeah, mm-hmm. I've been through that. Like, I still go through that. It just never ends. <laughs> yeah, that's what it feels like. Mm-hmm. Um, I do think I was very lucky to have, like, you guys in particular as a very good group of friends, you know? Because I think if I started streaming on my own and I did get a lot of people being kind of mean and stuff, it'd be harder if I didn't have, like, people who I felt would support me. Um, yeah, I think it's nice having a group of friends who do what you do because we can like empathize with each other and uh-huh. we've all been through it. Yeah. Except Michael. No one hates Michael. There, it it's because you don't stream. Yeah, yeah. Actually, I think I was thinking about it and I think that streamers get a lot more flack than YouTubers. At least YouTubers like me. Like people who don't upload very often and it's more like content focused. I think it's mm-hmm. it's harder to like judge the personality you know because the content is all in the forefront but streamers it's like you know multiple hours a day it's all like personality driven so it's so easy Mm -hmm. to attack the personality yeah and no one's personality is perfect but obviously people are gonna like nitpick if they don't like you it's just gonna happen yeah yeah Mm -hmm. you know i realized this is our D &D group oh yeah our dungeons and dragons group with one more person Coming soon. Ah, the mystery Secret. person. The mystery. I was actually shocked at who it was. Oh yes, um, don't spoil. But wait, we are... we're not we're not supposed to spoil. I, oh, do we know? I think who it, it oh. is. Oh wait. I'm, oh. Don't we? Do, there. Do in people the, know already? Know. I mean, well, I didn't did, say. No, no, anything. I don't. I don't think anybody knows, but like we know, right? Because. Oh yeah, we all know. Yeah, she's yes. in the group. I mean, he or she <laughs> is in the group. <laughs> <laughs> we started a D and D campaign. What? How, how long ago did we first start it? Uh, it was, it's like eleven episodes, so eleven weeks, so like wow. a few months. We yeah. skipped like three weeks. So, whew, what was that? Like three, three months ago? Months ish. Yeah. Yeah, and you know there was some learning pains. Saikuno and Michael were first time players. What was your yes. uh, first impression of D and D? You know, it was for me. It was like the role playing was difficult i don't know like to what level like everyone's supposed to go to because i haven't really even watched Uh dnd before so it's like not sure how much like time i'm supposed to take up but i think i mean we started to feel at least a little bit better about it as time went on yeah i felt the same way i was like not sure what to expect um and then it it ended up being you know pretty fun most of the time um I was definitely confused a lot, though. Um, yeah, yeah. Felt like, like I was not insane. contributing quite a bit. Yeah, me too. A lot of times I was just like, do I? So I thought it was fun, though. Yeah. When, but D&D, there's like the role playing aspect and there's the numbers aspect, like the dice rolls, the spells, the keeping yeah. track. And it's uh, the first time I did it, it was also very like. I don't know, it's kind of like nerds role-playing, imagining a fantasy world. But, uh, uh-huh. you know, you kind of just kind of make a fool on your, full of yourself and it's pretty fun. So, yeah, we're going to start a new one, kind of restart because, like, you know, some of the characters. I think, like, for my character, like, my governor daffodil guy, I was kind of glad when he died because I felt like <laughs> he didn't really have a... I couldn't I... really connect with him, you know? I felt that mm-hmm. way. For all your characters, I felt like no one was really connecting, uh, and that made for a frustrating role play because we had no direction, and yeah, yeah, the vibe was just off, honestly, for a while. So I think it was in both parties' best interest, and yeah. I did find another DM, and I learned a lot from the last campaign, like what not to do, like what to do better, etc. So I have. 
oh yeah and like not four hours anymore <laughs> i think no. that burnt yeah. all of us out right four hours yeah that was so that was quite we're gonna do mm -hmm. two and a half to three per week which is way better i think i think people will enjoy that more do you guys have an it. idea of uh, what your new characters might be ah uh, man i missed a mm. car Oh, sad. Me too. You, honestly, you can it's do a Descartes' world. twin brother, you know? You can <laughs> literally Descartes. bring back whoever you want. Like, it's, Yeah, it's, can I use the same character model? If, um, <laughs> if I make it close enough, like, it's not going to be the same but character. But I feel like you guys should experiment with yeah. other kinds of characters. I like to go, like... You don't like, want to, like... Yeah, I like to experiment opposite. as well. I'm trying not to do half-elf bard girls every campaign, <laughs> yeah. but that's what I like. Mm. I love... Bye. You know what she likes. Really, you gotta go the complete say, opposite direction strong. this time. Um, Too much aristocratic, haughty, you know, I standoff. I do a lot of, like, you do, noble, you do. Yeah. Uh, right? Yeah. You gotta get I, down I in the dirt. Maybe, yeah, like, orc barbarian. Gnomes <laughs> yeah. or... Orcs have uh, really good abilities, that 1 HP thing, right? I can That's do orcs. Gross. I want to do something I've never done before. So, like, orcs, gnomes. Uh, did I do a dwarf? Yeah, I did a dwarf already. Hmm. But like there are some other classes, right? Like I've never been a monk before, fighter, ranger. Uh, like there's a bunch of things you can do. It's just your imagination. I, feel like I, want, I want the same class so I don't have to learn new. Like I'm gonna be the fighter this time. You're gonna be a what? I'll um, be the fighter this time. So you have to pick something. Else. <laughs> oh. Um. Oh, I'm gonna have to do some some. We don't have like a date for the start yet. No, right? I so. specifically said I wanted like a little <clears throat> break so we can like kind of, you know, reset. Yep. And, and I think some more time so I can plan out my character better instead uh, of just yes. coming up with a name on the spot. Uh, yeah, I hope that. <laughs> um, yeah, we can do this better. <laughs> yeah. Well, like, like me and Michael were first time players. I definitely. Oh no, no, think I'm not. I'll this, do... I know you guys are new, but you know. Yeah. Just in general, better. I think I understand a lot more than the first time, so... Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Do you have any idea what you want your character to be, Sekuno? Is it bad if I say I was going to make a similar enough character where I didn't feel like I had to learn a new class? <laughs> oh, yeah. Totally. Yeah, just the same <laughs> class, but, like, what about personality and race? I would change... Yeah, I would be, like, the same dude, but, like, different personality, backstory. Mm. That's what I was thinking. Um, I don't like reading a lot. If you, you know, reuse read, um... stuff, I'm going to be upset. New or stuff. I could, I could try something new. Um, try something new. It's yeah. not that hard learning other stuff. You should you should just be like the mm. biggest asshole in the entire world. <laughs> and like um, role play as this huge jerk. Or we can, <laughs> how about this crazy idea? We can all role play something super nice. Like super comfy. Uh, um, or like the peace. Okay. Or, oh, oh, oh. Like, we role play as the villains. We were the villains, Toast. Oh, That's I guess true. we did become. We evil. were the villains. I, was, you know, I don't I know if this is clear. We I, were I all think... fucking evil. Yeah, I whoa, whoa, whoa. was the actual villain of that campaign. We did so much worse things. We were the villains. Can we try being the good guys now? Mm. Yeah, I, I feel like Potato. After all, his friends died. He was just. I was trying to go for He's the. Losing. He just lost it. Yeah, yeah. You, it was. You, um, you, you were. It was, okay. It was working. <laughs> it was working. I don't know. <clears throat> all right yeah. next topic uh, we have is uh first impressions we've kind of talked about this you know each other's impression let's talk about first okay. impression with saikuno oh well, well lily you, 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 you kind of talked well, about I already it right? told he, you he showed up my... with the bouquet of flowers well what did you think of that did you think i was crazy no i thought it was I mean... strange but it was really nice uh, <laughs> yeah that's why i never did it again i thought you were very <laughs> shy you were very no. shy I kind of still am. In, I think I've gotten better, though. At yeah, being you're, you're kind of the same, except like a little better. Okay, <laughs> everyone else's turn? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. When I first mentioned you, I, I had the same kind of impression that you were just extremely shy. And mm. do you like remember when we first met? When was the first time we met? Uh, uh, I wasn't asking. Like, because I knew I was asking to see if you remember, because oh, I uh, fucking don't. Yeah, I don't. Let's see, when did we first? Um, well, I think we said hi at the old offline TV house. Yeah, something like that. Um, we, but like we didn't, like, nice, talk a lot. We just, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, nice, shy gamer guy. Uh-huh. First impression, yeah. 
This is before we like started talking. We'll blame. Yeah, like more off. Yeah. 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 Uh huh. Tell us. <clears throat> Tell us. Well, my <laughs> first impression of you was similar to my first impression of Lily. It's like, drop the fucking act, bro. I know. I see <laughs> through you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, and, well, well, what do you think now? Uh, oh. And then you realize he's just like this twenty four seven. No, he's just he's just really good at keeping it up. But one day, <laughs> one oh, day he's gonna day. slip. Oh my God! Keep it up for like ten years, and eventually people will kind of like believe you, but kind of mm. not. But they'll kind of like tolerate you more. But until then, just like you know, be yourself. Right. That doesn't ex inspire much. Con uh. No, it's Thanks. the future is bleak. I'm going to be honest. But, <clears throat> mm -hmm. but you know, Saikuno, you have a huge fan base. Your viewership is popping off. So you're doing just fine. You know, just keep doing you. You don't have to change for anybody. The people <laughs> who aren't going to like you or like who aren't going to, you know, trust you, they're always going to be like that. They're Unless, always yeah, not yeah. going to like you. I think, yeah, I think that's the thing that really helped me a lot. Like thinking, understanding that, you know, like, People that probably are just gonna like hate, hate no me without that. bother. Yeah, exactly. They probably would have no matter what I do. So yeah, you know, uh, and the, the, the people yes. who like you will yeah. like you. Yeah, for you. Uh huh. And there's yeah. a portion of people who are just jealous because you know you have a lot of these thirsty girls going after you. No, no, and, like no, people are like, no. no, he can't. He, that like it violates their beliefs because you're you know you're not like this Chad <laughs> big muscle you know giant cock kind of guy. But you're this shy what? anime boy, <laughs> and like it, it flips their world upside down because shy anime ooh boys aren't supposed to get all the girls, so you know it's upsetting them. Oh, first of all, I, a I, don't, lot of I don't. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Whoa. Yeah, that's. Uh, whew. And also, I I don't think I like get a lot of girls. I just think a lot of people want to be nice to me. But that's also one it's of like the weird. A girl donated one thousand dollars to you yesterday. To kill. Well, that was Ray. to. Uh, wow, that was to um, kill another girl. She, she she wanted she you know she didn't she so her. much. <laughs> she gave you one thousand dollars to kill another girl, and you did it. Well, technically, multiple people added up to it. Oh, but, multiple uh, girls. Sorry, my apologies. I, <clears throat> but but I first of all, I just like to say I I messaged Ray. We're totally fine now. Um, or we were always uh anyway. That's fine. Why um, was. Hmm. 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 Huh? Hmm. Wait, why is everyone saying hmm? That's great. <laughs> she said oh. great because Please. it has the word Ray in it. Yes, I huh? made that was a very clever huh? no. I think that was word the joke she, word was to, she was trying to Oh, so you weren't doing that. Oh, so I, I picked up the observation on that. So no, I, I did it. That works every time. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so um, what are your first impressions of us? Who? Um, Let's start with Lily. You knew her yeah. the longest. Hers was a long time ago. My first impression was obviously I thought she was very nice, and um, I, this is gonna sound weird, but I'm not good at talking to people, and then especially like a girl, even if like I'm not like interested. You know what I mean? Like, it's so just, you oh, weren't like, interested. We were, for the record, what? You weren't interested. Oh, I mean, I was just like trying to make friends at, you know? Um, and I think the main reason I really wanted to leave a good impression was because, um, so even back then and also now streaming, I really just started streaming and making videos to try and make friends and stuff, you know? Um, didn't always work out perfectly. But I felt like, so Lily didn't have a face cam at the time. I actually didn't start using a face cam till. D &D. Just a few months, yeah, just a few months ago. Um, so I feel like I was like, maybe we're similar in some ways. Like we'd be good friends. Uh, you because know what? We're both, and we're both uh, INFP type nine wing one. Uh, yeah, crazy coincidence. Um, okay, sorry. So since we both didn't use face cams, I thought you know, but I mean, I didn't talk to her. Like I said, I I gave her these flowers, and then I got scared and ran off. And then here's the weirdest thing. I don't think Lily even remembers, probably. Or maybe she will. I don't know. Uh, you had this pink, like, leather purse thing. What the flower? Um, um, and... I remember, kind of. Yeah, go on. Yeah, and then the first thing I saw you do was stab a pin through it. And I was like, isn't that made of leather? Should you be stabbing that? I don't know why I remember that. 
But I thought that was interesting. That's so just specific <laughs> memory that I had, I don't know. <laughs> that's okay. okay. That's okay. Okay. So here's here's my theory. I remember random things because like, um, well, I talk about because I you have a master's in statistics. <laughs> No, I have a yes. terrible memory sometimes, but it's because like I don't hang out with people. Like, I don't hang out with people often, so, so I remember a lot of things because like I feel like my memory of hanging out with friends' storage space is empty. So I remember <laughs> random stuff that like I probably don't need to. Um, okay. But yeah, my first impression was not like much because we didn't talk much, you know. Um, I liked your car. Thank you. He I liked it nice too. He had a nice car. He had this <clears throat> nice, nice car with red leather interior. That was sick. Uh, thanks. I I actually don't have a car now. I, yeah, uh, I know. But you know, I'm talking like way back then. Yeah, it was a nice. I car. I missed that car. It was a good car. Curfew. Cur I think this is the first time I've gone through curfew before. I mean, I didn't experience that in Canada or like, you know anywhere i live so it's a it's a very different experience i think that um yeah it's crazy yeah neither have i and i've only ever lived in california too um so it's it's crazy year a lot I of hope. stuff um, um yeah yeah it's crazy. I just hope everyone you know try their best to stay safe you know, there's a lot going on, especially with Corona still, like all like yeah. the crazy yeah. stuff going. And then like, there's oh, corona. that global pandemic. That's like, you know what they say? There are two pandemics now, Corona and racism. Yeah. It's, yeah. It's, uh, I feel like racism. I suppose one on was always. A while longer. Yeah. Yeah. But I feel like um, this is like, this feels like a tipping point for a lot of people, you know? To uh -huh. enact like actual changes, like almost like a revolution. So I hope like actual persisting changes happen though. Yeah. Me too. Because it seems it's it's big. Everyone's coming together to fight for this. Yeah, it's like it's a very massive movement. Well warranted. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Sekuno didn't say what his impression was of me and Michael yet. Uh. <clears throat> oh right. Um You know, I think the first time I met Michael, I we just like very light talk. I feel like my first impression of everyone is always we barely talk, so I, I don't really know. <laughs> um, Michael seemed nice though, I thought, um, and very humble too. Because, like, so when I met Michael, I actually didn't see his videos before I met him. Um, <laughs> oh, so you, you don't know like what a big deal he is? Well, I found out later, and I, I think I was actually very impressed at how, um, I don't know if smart is the right, like, obviously he's smart, but I mean, like, um, logical. He has very good uh, thoughts. Like, I was watching some of his older videos. Um, I was very impressed at how smart he was. And also, after, like, finding out, I guess, I was like, wow, that guy is so nice for someone who is, like, um, you know how they say, like, power corrupts or something like that? The name changes right people, you mean? Yeah, or? you ever heard that before? Or some people yes. think it just lets you be who you normally were. That's a different topic, though. Um, I was just like, wow, that guy was so nice, and he didn't have to be. Um, so I had a very good impression of Michael, and it's only gone up since then. Like, um, Wow. Yeah. I think there's actually few people, I think, where um, I thought they were super cool at first, and then they've only gone up since then. Um, so I feel like get along pretty well with them um really nice person um see that's why i don't like to get to know people because like if they oh. think i'm super cool at the beginning if they get to know me more it can only i go feel down. the same way actually that's your also, insecurity I hope I don't... talking yeah yep i think if people get to know me more Hmm, actually, let me think about this. <laughs> now your insecurity is starting. Oh, no, it's like <laughs> spreading. Oh, We're oh. influencing her. Yeah. I do have My... like... Sorry, Lon. Sorry. Oh, no, no, go ahead. No, 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 um, go, go, go. Oh, no, I, well, I was going to move to toast, so I wanted to stay on this. Uh, you, oh, yeah, you, yeah, yeah, You should... No, no, you should... I... No, 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 it's not. You just, just do... Just... What were you going to say This is what toast? happens when two doormats I... run into each other. <laughs> Shut up! 
um, well, I was just going to say my first impression of Toast. Um, when was the first time I met you? Was it at the Joker movie or? No, uh, yeah, wow. we were having dinner or? at the Grove in oh. that food court area. Oh my uh-huh. god, that's when we all went out. Ah, oh, I remember. Oh yes, yeah, Sakuna, we were flaming the shit out of you before. We you were not. Up. What? <laughs> we were not. I I was I was late a little bit, so. We I, were not, um, Sakuna. I promise you, we weren't. Okay. I try my best not to be late. I beat up um, people who flame you. Mm-hmm. Oh, that is true. I would, I would, I would um, flame you, and then Lily would be like, "Hey, Toast, that's not very nice, you know." He's a nice guy. <laughs> she would. I actually <laughs> like that. Um, I don't think Toast actually meant anything mean, but I oh, do. He does I did he re- appreciate. Toast is yeah. harmless. Like he's super harmless. He's like the. He's like he's, he's a, a marshmallow. He's a very nice person. He's yeah. actually a marshmallow. He'll say all these like, biting things, but you know. You ever deep heard inside, of those Tassoon Dares? He's um, a. He's hundred percent. He's a hundred percent. Yeah. Tsundere. Yeah. Maybe a little bit more. Hundred percent. Yeah. I feel like. I when I first met Toast, I thought he hated me. Um, nah. I legit, I thought he hated me, and then why would um, you think I me? hated you? If I'm like well, a porcupine, you know, you're like porcupine. Uh, what is Toast? What's hard on the outside but soft on the inside? Um, like like a animal. French fry, like <laughs> you know those French those thick French fries that are like crispy on the about. outside and they're mushy on the inside. Hmm. Um. Michael, you're like an engineer. Yeah, Do you best. know anything? <laughs> um, let me look at my engineer lexicon. Um, like a watermelon. A watermelon, <laughs> maybe. Like yeah, like a little Sorry. sweet on the inside, but on the outside, okay, maybe like a little uh, bit. I'm not feeling um, that one. You're uh, like like oh, a oh, s'more. Oh, oh, you're like a burnt marshmallow, where it's scary on the outside and soft on the inside. Um, you're like oh, I know. Um, I know. You know, like those. Okay, okay. Hear me out. All you right. see this water bottle? Yes, I. It's hard on the outside, but inside there's delicious filtered water. Metal on the inside. No, but yeah. in, the inside is water, which is so, you know. Can we? Should we just go on? Hey, Lily. Uh, on? Can you do me a favor? Yeah. Can you uh, with your feet put it on the ground? Put your legs on the ground. No. Huh? And like tap a certain amount. Like mer- Morse code, uh, you're, you're tapping a lot. You just tap like between one and five. Are you trying That's to hear three, right? Can... Is that SOS and fucking Morse? Okay, Wait, toast, do it does that mean you're in the very light? You're in the. I heard two. <laughs> Holy shit! You hear that, Lily? I hear that. I, I wanna... love living here. I need. <laughs> I need. Privacy. I can't. Oh, you you yeah. know what Fed said? Remember? Dude, the walls are so. Fucking when I'm typing, thin. like really, like loud, right? So this is how I type, right? Uh-huh. Fed can right. hear that from upstairs. That's disgusting. Wow. And then I was sniffing once, like sniffling. He heard that upstairs as well. Mm. It's I. This house. Um. Sound. Hmm. It's like when I have to record stuff, yeah. like I can't. Like I feel so self conscious because I know people can hear me, and it sucks. Dude, nah. Oh, like when you're doing auditions. Over? Like how I, I, make, I, I don't hear I don't know. Huh? <laughs> if Scarra ever brings a girl over, there's no way I don't hear it. I'm gonna have to go to sleep listening to that. You I can, could just get earplugs. What? what the fuck? But what if I oh, want earplugs to? are huge in this house. Oh yeah, everyone has earplugs. I started using earplugs too because <laughs> I, I sleep with that shit. Sound no. travels. So, do you have like reusable? Are there reusable earplugs, or do you have I like? Think you um, can just reuse them. Like, uh, I don't think they're like a disposable thing. No, yeah, they don't seem that. They don't seem this. Yeah, like they, oh. yeah, yeah. You guys ever clean your that. ears yourself? Yes. Do, do you yes? ever get like? What, what do you guys use? These oh Q-tips. no! I I bought um the set. You know the Asian metal like earwax cleaning. Yeah, thing? yeah. I have one of those. Oh, it's like a little. Par- yeah, yeah, yeah. My parents. It's like a used mini back scratcher. Is what it looks like to me. I yeah. bought a set of those. So. Uh huh. It's really nice. So like you, you hook. Oh no, no, it up. Michael does it for me. No, oh. no, no, I scoop the oh. wax out of her ear sometimes. Like, I get. Wait, like, does it come with a, a flashlight? Wait, yeah, well, I get my lamp and uh-huh. I like I put her head goes down like uh, like like on the side and then I like bring the lamp over the head and then I have this like 
Oh no, he's really proud of this. <laughs> you could just see him. Um. What? Oh, oh, oh! Like you're you're oh, mining, right. like you're a miner. Wow, that looks intense. Yeah, and then you can like. You have a flip down video. magnifying glass. Yeah, he, the little magnifying glass. He yeah. actually he really likes it. He well, has been like playing a lot of Minecraft. Minecraft. To each his own. Uh, mm -hmm. It feels good, doesn't it? When someone's like digging. Around oh my in god! There. You have no idea. It, I'm like, yes. It's like it's like scratching an itch that you can't reach otherwise. Does that make sense? Uh huh. Yeah. Very nice. No, but you said Kuno, you clean your ears. Um, well, not super often, and if I do, I don't do it very deep. Um, right of I do use here. earbuds, so like if I don't, they'll the ear they'll get on the earbuds, which is a little. <laughs> so that's why that's the main reason. Um, yeah, that, that ever happened to you with earbuds? Um, uh, no, but recently I was picking with like a tweezer. And I yeah. pulled out enough earwax that it's almost like earplugs. Oh, dude, that happened with Lily. She Ooh. had like the fucking <laughs> cheesecake factory production <laughs> line all in her fucking ear. Why did you out, tell like, them this? She's like, are you done yet? Michael. And I'm picking out little bits. And, I, and she's like, wow, that's a lot. And I was like, no, that's not a lot. Compared to the fucking monster. I can see it. Michael! Um, the whole factory. Michael! Like, well, how did it feel when it came out and you saw how big it was? It was nice. Did I tell you? Yeah. Years ago, I suffered from like a mu hearing loss in my right ear. And I didn't know why. It was bad. It was completely muffled. Like, I couldn't hear anything. Right? Uh -huh. So, I went to an ear doctor thingy where they do it for you. And then they were like... Oh my god, right? <laughs> <laughs> I had impacted earwax, okay? Uh -huh. And I needed mm. two... I think I... Did I need two trips to get it all out? I don't remember, but anyway. Um, oh. Once they got it all out, like, they showed me. And I'm like, the things that could be in your ear is crazy. I'm like, how did that... How did that even happen? Sometimes when you use Q-tips, right, to clean your ear, sometimes you actually shove the earwax even deeper in, which oh. leads to more impacted earwax. I've heard earwax. about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you have to be careful. <laughs> earwax is your ear's like natural way of, you know, cl cleaning your canal and stuff. So I learned a lot about um, earwax and your ear canal, actually. It's Had very... It wasn't yeah. that much younger. <laughs> it was like a few I feel like years I'd be ago. extremely scared if... I was at a doctor and they were freaked. Like if the doctor is like, I haven't seen this before, that's when I'm just like, mm. Oh, I mean, they didn't do that. They were just like, Oh, okay. They, they were like, okay, this is what they did. Like, whoa, look at my ear. Uh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> that's a lot of earwax, you know, like that kind of stuff. I'm like, okay. okay yeah, that's a lot less bad. That's less yeah. bad. Were you, were you like glad when it would end oh. up being earwax and not like hearing damage? Yes, I was actually so paranoid because oh, I'm yeah. like, why is my hearing going when I'm like 20 or something, you know? Yeah, so, but that was fucking scary. It was, it was. And then like afterwards, I could hear so clearly. <laughs> Reminds me of the time we went skydiving and my I thought I was I would never get my hearing back. Oh my god. Did you know you're not supposed to fuck. skydive when you're congested? Something about the pressure and everything. Oh, the pressure can't be released mm -hmm. as quick. So yeah. I was uh -huh. super congested, but I went skydiving for a one million subscriber thingy. My ears popped. It was excruciating pain. I was crying while I was perishing. Wait, what did the yeah. instructors think to have this crying girl? <laughs> okay, so it's tandem skydiving. So the instructor's like holding on to me, right? And she's like, you're doing great. Like, we're almost there. And I'm like, it hurts. And I'm like, yeah, just try to cover your ears. I'm like, it hurts. <laughs> I'm like crying. I couldn't enjoy uh, it. It hurts uh, so yeah. bad. Oh, my God. And then we afterwards, fucking hate muffled. Hate both ears. Just no... Mm. I could barely hear anything, and I'm like, "Wow, did I fuck up my hearing permanently?" But and Michael was a uh, nauseous. Uh, I, I got very sick. On that. Very sick. I, yeah. He was, I was green. Yeah, I was loving it, and then like as like immediately, like a second later, I was like, "Oh, I'm gonna throw up all over this nice man's feet." <laughs> it was like, fucking instantaneous. Would you go skydiving? After uh, those stories, no. Well, just don't be <laughs> that a good time. No, hold, hold, what, would you guys? Would you two do it again? Hell uh, no. Uh, I don't. I, I didn't. Okay, so my answer is no. Then my answer is probably no. But it's um, cool to like. After, it's a good one time. Experience. Yes, like so you can say you've been skydiving, right? Yeah. 
So um, I'd like to try everything once, you know, bungee jumping. Me too. Try I, everything once. I mean, if everybody has said that it wasn't the best experience, um, or but not I, everybody, but it wasn't bad. Like the view up there is like insane like seeing everything below you like that is like yeah, wow that was very cool that was crazy mm -hmm. jumping out of the plane like that initial feeling is like that oh, adrenaline is yeah is crazy. it's like everything in your body is telling you not to like jump out of the plane it's like, <laughs> it's fucking natural instinct to not jump out of a fucking plane <laughs> wow but then you do it because the asshole who's instructing you pushes you out of the plane they push you and i'm like oh my god wow yeah you're not selling me on this too hard um, <laughs> <laughs> and you pay money for them to <laughs> I mean we did it for like a subscriber oh, thing right. so maybe you can do it for fun. a subscriber Ooh. thing too so, yeah, if I hit a million subscribers you're gonna skydive do it say it uh, commit if, well. I, if, if, if I could get some I wouldn't want to go alone okay right? fine I would have to but get someone to go can with can you me. say it if I get a million subscribers if I get a million subscribers <laughs> I will skydive. <clears throat> I mean, if, if I actually get a million, I would. If oh, I can get a friend to go with me. You heard it here. If I can get a friend to go with me. Well, look, it's, it's never going to happen, you know? That's what I thought. Uh, and then, you know, you never so, know. Anyway. You yeah. thought you damaged your ears? Yeah. Here's a, here's a question. Your eardrums ruptured. Oh, my God. They, like, ruptured. It hurt. They, the, they, like, it was really bad. Oh, yeah. Okay, out of uh, the five senses, which one would you guys lose if you had to choose one? If you had to give up one, eyes, taste, hearing, I've got the smell, touch, touch. I yeah, probably won't do. Uh, uh, um, is touch. Let's, let's, let's exclude touch. I, this, so like hard sight, yeah. hearing, taste, smell, and, and taste is kind of like inter. I would probably get rid of either taste or smell. I imagine. I then you'd never be able to enjoy food. <laughs> like, I mean, taste. I usually just eat random smell? stuff. So, smell is whatever. Think there's something about smell, like, like smell could save you from gas, right? I mean, smell, gas like, leak. smell is like, like tr can trigger memories the hardest of any sense. I think mm, is what people say. like when you smell true, like true. I don't know, like the perfume that like your parents wore when you were a kid. You're like, oh, uh, I'm reminded of my childhood. Uh huh. But, like it's got like something to do with memory and like helping memories stick yep isn't but, that there's something about that right but like i would never be able to give up music and like True, art yeah. is also super important so ultimately mm -hmm. i think i give up smell yeah i would you, probably give yeah. up smell or taste yeah if you give out smell you can take out the trash without feeling disgusting because you can yep. take a big <sighs> and but you won't be bothered i wouldn't be able to like enjoy food as much you know you could That's smell depressing. food, right? Like you know when you smell food and you're like that smell. Have you tr good. have you eaten like plugging your nose like without a sense of smell? Have you tried eating? Uh, it's well, weird. like if I'm sick with a stuffy nose. <laughs> it's like it feels it's like I'm choking. You it's can't really <laughs> taste it to its fullest. Like you can tell if it's like yeah. salty, yeah. spicy, hot, that kind yeah, of weird, stuff. A weird yeah. amount of eating is smell. Yeah, it's yeah, a lot I feel of like, like a lot. That's what people say when bit. you take, you know, like Little kids when you do cold medicine, they'll plug your nose and like drink it right and stuff. Right, here's another question. Would you rather lose both eyes or both arms? Oh, fuck. That's, that's a big of... question. Arms, so I can get prosthetic arms. arms. Uh, that's what I was about to say. I was going to say get technology eyes. eyes. Yeah, but you have to link so. it to the brain too, right? Yeah, if you yeah, lose your arm, the possible. links are already there. Uh, your eyes, you would have to link it. It's more risky, okay. I would say. How about one? Think... only one? One eye or one arm? Oh, okay. One arm. So, because you can Probably live with one me. eye. I yeah. Can, yeah. But you're yeah, You have no death perception, right? I'd probably yeah, still lose the arm. Play though. sports. Nice. Yeah. Now that I think about it, it's probably. I would lose an arm. I would lose can yeah. get that replaced. Wait, no, wait. What? Wait. I, I, I. Yeah, I would no, lose I would an lose eye, one eye before I, I lose, lose one arm. But you can get a prosthetic uh, arm. You can't eye. really get a prosthetic eye, right? I only need that's, one okay, eye. That that's what I was thinking. But then also, yeah, I'm like, so this gonna sound really weird. When I was younger, yeah. I heard that you need two eyes to really figure out how far away, blah, 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 right? It's so like I, triangulation, I think. I wanted to yeah. test it out, so I would, I covered my eye for a really long time just to uh, see. And I remember mm -hmm. it being like, like, it's like uncomfortable. I don't know how to word it. You can't, really? like, after you, a while, it's like weird. 
Yeah, yeah. If you like put a, if you try to close one eye and then you aim at a spot on your table and you try to bring your finger down on that spot, you like cannot hit. It. Everyone listening to this podcast just close their eye and started pumping things. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> pumping <laughs> Um. Oh, you're I, right. I missed. Yeah, yeah. Because you have no. I actually. Perception. Yeah, I thought I would yeah, get it completely. because like. I was like, okay, my mouse is right here. Grab it yeah. all the time. Um, I don't know. I don't know which is more important: the hand the eye coordination, because <laughs> you're gonna lose one of them. <laughs> yeah, like having both hands is great. But depth perception. So let us know in the comments mm-hmm. which one you prefer, or no, would rather lose. Yeah. Haha. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> get, get, get the interaction. Yeah. What's it called? Um, engagement. engagement engagement pretty new to all these terms um i could never masturbate with my other hand it's just as possible. wait really toast. really like it's, it's like someone else <laughs> it's just like, it's like a different person the angle is completely off it's this it's the same angle though no you know, no, no, like, no, no, no no all right everyone go to bed tonight and when you do it the other <laughs> hand it's it's like a, it's different it's different yeah, I like. But I think with enough practice. Yeah, like <laughs> if it's the only option, you can live with it. But because like this, right? The, the why are you pressures, holding that water? Oh, you're trying. The oh. pressure is on the right side. Should I just leave? But but can this. I? No, 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 no. If you want to talk about, you know, masturbation, go ahead. Just let me know when you're done. Uh, yeah. Okay. Um, why yeah, I are you? Okay. Um, I think we're done. I'm gonna eat after this. We're uh, all gonna maybe eat. Valorant or Minecraft. We're gonna or eat both. and then play. Are we gonna... Oh yeah, we've been playing a lot of Minecraft lately. Oh. We have. Yeah, because Valorant went fun. down for uh, three days and uh, we were looking for something. And uh, Lily and Michael started with their little hardcore server like a week ago. And then you guys restarted Minecraft. But this time it wasn't a hardcore. It's nice. Yeah. I really love seeing everyone's houses. Like, like and making this little town. I love that aspect a lot. Mm. Yeah, we got to like a community. Yeah, I love everyone's houses are very, you know, unique. Uh huh. I like your jungle tree, Saikuno. It's very tall. Honestly, Ray did most of the work on it. Saikuno <laughs> um, yeah, and Ray spent like out like, actual hours trying to find yeah. a jungle biome. I'm actually the impressed they traveled that far. It's crazy. Yeah, thirty-seven thousand. Thirty-seven thousand blocks. I actually checked the seat again to see how far we would have had to keep going in the same direction. Yeah, we would have had to go for another like. Uh, almost 50,000 blocks to oh, actually hit a jungle. Oh, that's right. God. oh my god. So we would have been searching for <laughs> so long. <clears throat> several <Okay>. days. Um, <laughs> bad luck. Bad luck. Yes. Yeah. I like where our house is, though. It's surrounded by like four biomes, which is pretty cool. And yeah. we're in the flower oh, yeah. forest biome, which is also pretty cool. Yeah, like every time I play Minecraft, I feel like I play like once a year. They update so much. Like when we yeah. jumped in, there was like bees and rabbits. And I can oh, remember yeah. when we first like when Minecraft first started, it was just like cow, chicken, sheep, and that was it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Now there's mm-hmm. squid, salmon, water zombies, desert zombies. Is the Ender yep. Dragon the final boss still, or is there like more after that? Well, um, I think like... there's the Wither. Yeah, you could do a little stronger. Bit. Wither is stronger for sure. Yeah. Never killed those either. We uh we still need to kill the Ender Dragon. Yeah, we do. <clears throat> now everyone's playing Valorant, so it's gonna be a minute. Yeah. You know what? You can also resummon the Ender Dragon. Games kill. come and go, but Minecraft is eternal. True. Yep. Huge true. Minecraft just keeps coming back. It fucking refuses to die. There's anything to get out of this podcast? Minecraft is uh forever. <laughs> yeah, because like people are constantly making kids, and these kids eventually reach an age where they like Minecraft. Uh huh. So I feel like if you're a Minecraft content creator, you will never run out of kids, because they just keep coming out. 
And then once they yep. discover Minecraft, they really get into it. It's such a good game. Like, it's, mm -hmm. it's a really good game. I love the creativity. Yeah. I like how like Lily plays a different way from like how I play. We play different plays games. a different yeah. way from uh -huh. how like Yvonne plays. But we're still like playing Minecraft, you know? She's just like off like building houses and collecting bees and flowers and shit. And I'm like, mm -hmm. you know, trying to fight the Ender Dragon and get the best <laughs> loot, find <laughs> cool and shit. farms and stuff. But like yeah. it facilitates both of our play styles still. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's really it's really cool. Really nice game. Ooh. So we're gonna Eat some uh, some dinner today, and uh, yeah. we're gonna go. Oh, oh! For those who don't know, Lily may look small, but wait till you see what? her eat boiling crab the seafood <laughs> restaurant, and you'll be physically amazed at what she can do with her stomach when it comes to shrimp. <laughs> How much pounds um, was the last time, Lily? Three. Three pounds. There was three pounds of shrimp in her stomach. Like <laughs> Michael took a picture That's, of um... like both their piles of like oh. shrimp shells, <laughs> and it was about like close more than double. Lily had oh, 100%. wow. You're you're a big shrimp fan, huh? I can eat a lot. Mm -hmm. I like shrimp. And when you yeah. put those two things together, she's kind of been starving herself all day for this as well. No, I haven't. You had you, you had a bit of chicken, yeah. You gave me food today. That was nice. Toasts ordered food, and then he played it. He got extra and plated it all for everyone in the house, and like wrapped it up with saran wrap and everything. It was like super nice. It was like chicken rice and coleslaw or something. Very nice. See, yeah, I'm hyping you up. You're, you're yeah, cool toast is very nice. I think. Okay. Yeah, he's a. Again, okay. he's a marshmallow. Okay. Like, uh huh. To Sundere. So, what is soft in the <clears throat> inside but hard on the outside? Do you and, know in the comments? And... Let me know. He's, he's like a toasted marshmallow. Because, like, <gasps> toast. Ah. Can we name the podcast Toasted, toasted. Marshmallow? Uh huh. It's like if you're around a cozy campfire and. Yeah, toast yeah, yeah. And... It's like kind of crispy on the outside. Uh, crispy okay, on the outside. You know, the faster the we finish this podcast, the faster we can eat. Saikuno, huh? Where can people find you? <clears throat> uh, like what? Oh my god, Saikuno, like... just shout out your socials. Holy oh, shit, that man. kind just, of find just, me. Um, just, yeah, just like tell that, them your social media know. handles. Just tell them where to find you on Twitch. Oh my god. Oh, Twitch slash Saikuno. Okay, and YouTube. Saikuno. Slash Saikuno. Everything Twitter. Saikuno. Really? Except yeah, for Saikuno. Instagram. Ooh. Like yeah. Except for Instagram. Oh, Instagram's different. Saikuno got taken by some dude. Um, Wait, what's, what's, it, what's your Instagram? Saikuwu. I had the chat vote on it. I don't... Um... <laughs> but you you went through with it. Okay, let's not yeah. blame chat here. They said I think it's a cute name. Saik I mean, Saikuno got taken, so... Saikuno's a cool name. Like... Like a username. Wait, like how'd you come up with this? Oh, yeah. yeah, this is really weird. I actually just thought it sounded cool and just stuck That's with it. That's pretty cool. Ah. Like, it's an yeah. cool. I think yeah, there's yeah. some people who have like, story. really good branded names, like Sekuno is one. I like Skara a lot. Disguised Toast is also really unique, you know? Um, mm -hmm. Pokemon Michael actually, Reeves. And uh, not that's that unique. just his name, though, isn't it? I really like my creative um, name. <laughs> Pokemon, Fedmeister. It's like very unique names that uh -huh. no one would have, really. Yeah, I think we're all really good at coming. Lily Pichu. Actually, for the longest time, my Twitter was not Lily Pichu. It was something oh. else, because someone took Lily Pichu. Uh. I think that person eventually got tired of people like messaging her, that she changed it on her own accord. I never talked to her. So that's how I got it. Ah. Ah, you should hear what Pokimane's uh, Twitter account holder is. She, she just, I think huh? they just ask for money every now and then. It's like, all right, the price is X, Y, and Z. Wait, seriously? Yeah. <laughs> that's a squatter. Oh, that's kind of kind of lame, but okay. Mm. Yeah, I think they post like once a month just to make sure it never, uh, never uh, <laughs> expires. Smart. Yeah. That's smart. That's uh. smart. Oh man. All right. <clears throat> uh, yeah. 
You can find Saikuno. He plays with us very often, pretty much daily nowadays. He's going to be on our Dungeons and Dragons campaign. You're going to see a lot of Saikuno. Hit him up, ladies. He is single. <laughs> or guys... You, know. Dude, you should hit up Toast too. He's also single. You guys are both single. This is we, true. We are both single. Yep. If you want the cute, shy anime boy, you can go for Sakuno. <laughs> if you want that alpha, you know, wealthy, <laughs> well, you powerful. If, if you know what I think? Toasted marshmallow. <laughs> you guys are like um, opposites. Toast, hmm? you're like really like abrasive on the outside, but like inside you're really soft. Sakuno. You're soft oh, yeah. on the outside, but you probably have some like shadowy shit yeah, going on inside that yeah. no one knows. Oh, you guys are just I, yeah, the yeah, same, uh, like uh, the same coin, same size, same of, size the of the same coin. Two coin. sides of the same coin. Um, <laughs> I um, uh, toast any. Would you rather? About that? I'm mm -hmm. curious. Would you rather have a guy? Let's just put yourself like as a girl or a guy, whatever, right? Mm -hmm. Would you rather have a guy who's like? You know, like kind of snarky on the outside, but really nice on the inside, or a guy who's really nice on the outside, but like really edgy on the I inside. I think all girls would prefer the hard on the outside, soft on the inside. That's yeah, not I what they prefer. That too. <laughs> okay. Because yeah. well, if they actually don't like you on the inside, then it doesn't. No, that it doesn't mean that they don't like you. Huh? They just like I guess. I What's think it means more to girls when they see a guy be a dick to other people, but like when it comes to her, he's like polite and nice because it makes her feel special one thing i learned it's from like women personality negative. yeah <clears throat> is that, that women love to feel special okay you are That's such a, a you are ch <sighs> whoa <laughs> look do you not like to feel special that's okay there's something well i mean ev everybody wants to everybody feel special, wants to feel right? special I mean, especially, women. Women. Other. especially I, women you need to I, <laughs> I think everybody does and i i i think that's not the only way or maybe not even the best way to make someone feel special, you know? I'd like to see uh, a guy treat everyone kindly. I think that shows more on his character, right? That you all do. You all, all of you here, treat everyone. Look, else girls kindly. like bad. You have you've heard the phrase, "girls like bad boys." They like bad boys for That's a, a generalization. Is that true? Yeah. Is that true? Girls I like mean, bad. Boys. I think some guys um, confuse the term with confidence. Like, girls like confidence, but that doesn't mean they like assholes. I feel like it's so... Uh, you know, sometimes people just confuse the two a look, lot. Look, look, look. Take example Zuko <laughs> from the Avatar, The Last Airbender. In season one, he was a huge asshole committing, like, you know... He got even times, more... But he got assassins. even more fans with his personality change and mature, maturity, right? Uh -huh. This is true. This is true. He became way more attractive later on. Yeah, because he was, you know, like rude and abrasive. But as time goes on, you saw the softer side of him, like the kinder side of him, and made girls fall in love with them. So the lesson he here, had, uh -huh. they f no, no, they fell in love with the kinder side. You mean to tell me people like that whiny ass firebender Ark Zuko from season one? Nah, with that haircut. <clears throat> Nah. Okay, He's but like, coming. no, 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 no. What if he came out the bat? Like season one, he was a season three personality. Like you know, nice and like thoughtful. No, I don't give a shit about him. Don't call I him a give simp. A shit. Oh my! God. If simp was a word in season like season three, they would call him a simp. I will debate you on this. <laughs> anyway, um, I think we're done. Yeah. Uh, that's gonna be mm -hmm. it for us on this week. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Um, any parting words? My parting words just, you know, please just stay safe, you know, from everything yep. that's going on right now, like coronavirus and, you know, unrest. It's, it's definitely a difficult time. Um, do your research. It's very confusing, like, even, like, I mean, personally, I don't know, like, I don't know what's going on anymore, but I just want mm -hmm. everyone to like care about your safety. Can, yeah, I think yeah. we can all stand behind, like you know, ra not racism. You know what I mean? Yes. Yeah, I can stand yeah, behind not racism. We said it. <laughs> like Black Lives Matter. You know. Like I, these are things we can all like stand yeah, behind together. Given. So yeah, yeah. general. Given. But like, yeah. there is a lot of misinformation out there. It's like I'm still yeah. researching and reading, and it's. Sometimes it's hard saying, like, what is true? Like, I don't know. 
Racism yeah. bad, as we like to say on Goodbye. The offline TV. I'm podcast. leaving. Bye. Bye. <laughs> See you guys at Tramp. Bye. Bye.